So, uh, we'll do Thanksgiving with me and Christmas with you? Wow. Really? Wow. <laughs> You're amazing, Amelia. Bye. Hey, so, come, sit. Sit, come on. So, uh... You're, you're talking to Amelia? Yeah, we talk every day. She's bringing Leo here so we can have the holidays all together. You don't think that's something that you should have asked? It's true love, Teddy. You really want to ask permission? True, you love her? How can you not love Amelia? It's Amelia. So she comes first? No, no, God, no. Christina comes first. Wait, but you, you married me. You, you chose me. Oh, this is good. Listen. It's not your fault that you don't know how to love. What did you just say to me? I said I love you. Oh. And passive gravy, but I also love you. This this doesn't feel right. Because it's not. The only reason that I came here, the only reason that we have a baby together is because of Amelia. <sighs> you know what? We really should be thanking her. You want to call her back, or should I? Get out of my house. You know, you say that a lot, but you never really mean it. That's why I keep coming back. It's sort of a thing. I don't want it to be our thing. Well, then the only alternative is you realize... One of these days... One of these days what? Dessert. Ah, yes. You'll burn yourself. I got it, Amelia. Teddy, it's Teddy. What's wrong with Teddy? You keep looking past me like you always do, even though I'm right here. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. I am done waiting for you and feeling like this every time. I'm done. It's Teddy. I know, right? I love Teddy, but... She's no you, Amelia. Here. Eat. It's your favorite. So you guys haven't talked since... Since she humiliated me at work and destroyed our family? No. I was gonna say, since you brought her home. I just want to make sure that she's okay, and I'm gonna head back to the hotel. Oh, I... Amelia, I don't want to talk to her, because every time I do, it just makes me angrier. Okay? And I'm exhausted by it. So I'm done. Can you pass me the side part, please? What about therapy? I go to therapy. With Teddy? I don't need to pay some stranger to sit there and listen to Teddy lie to me. Would you cut her some slack? She just lost DeLuca. We all lost DeLuca. I was standing right across from her the day that he died. But we don't all have the luxury of just shutting down completely. I want her to be well. Obviously, I do. I mean, Leo's been asking to see his mom all day... I had to lie to him and say that she was working because I don't want him to see her like this. He needs her. You know, Allison needs her, but honestly, honestly, I don't. Oh, and all she's ever done is lie to me. That's all she's ever done. She didn't tell me she was pregnant for months. She cheated on me for weeks before our wedding night. And, and you remember Allison, Teddy's best friend, died, the one we named our daughter after? Well, it turns out that she's not just her best friend. She's the love of Teddy's life. And she didn't mention it to me once. In all the decades that we've known each other, not once. She just mentioned it as some kind of excuse for all the horrible things that she's done. There's nothing I can do about it, and talking doesn't help, okay? So can we please just build this bed? 